these ones. These are so cute, by the way. Wow. Right, ready? Let's go. Okay, hello guys. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is actually going to be a bit of a makeover like room makeover vlog i love watching these organization videos they just motivate me to get my life sorted um but yeah it's in no way gonna be a decor video because we're renting we don't know how long we're gonna be here i'm not decorating this room i'm not gonna put much money into it because that's just silly um we could literally leave in six months so um, I'm trying to work with things I already have from like the previous house. Yeah, this is my filming room slash dressing room. So I work in here, I get ready in here, and I needed it to be clear, practical, functional. And I am actually working with Desenio for this video, which is so exciting because if you watch my last living room decor video, then you'll see that I bought their prints last year and I loved them. I had them up on the living room wall. So yeah, when they wanted to work with me, I was so excited because I love their stuff. Um, so they've sent me a few prints and I'm just gonna show you them quickly. And they have actually given me a code for you guys to use. So if you enter Yasmin B at checkout, you can get 35% off your prints and that is valid until the 20th of December. By the way, this code does not include frames, handpicks or personalized prints. So anything else, 35% off. Yeah, let me show you the other options that I had for this room that I'm now gonna use in the living room. I saw this one and it's like a French um, ink sketch, ink drawing like this and it just has really neutral colors in there. I did actually want to have more color in this room so I'm gonna put this in the living room instead and it has French writing on it. So a little ode to my French degree. <laughs> and then the matching print looks like this. So again, it's like this. How beautiful. I picked up this one. It's really cute. It's just like a woman's face. And it says Stockholm Gallery. I find it so hard to say that word, Stockholm. Stockholm. <laughs> I don't know why. Oh my goodness, this one is so pretty. Just a little line drawing of a woman's body. This would look so good in the bigger size as well. It just looks such good quality. Yeah, I'm gonna put this up in the bedroom probably. And the next one is a bit of a joke. Um, it just reminds me of my mum's sense of humor. I was gonna give it to her to put up in the bathroom. Um, and it just says, deja vu, the feeling that you've heard this crap before, mood. So yeah, that was a bit of a jokey one, but they have a lot of like text prints as well on there. I don't wanna give anything away, but I'll show you the prints. Wow, okay. This is one of the prints that I've put up. Again, I've done like a set. The color in it, I really just wanted a pop of color in this room and this just has orange in it, which is different. I also got this in the biggest size and it matches with this one here. How beautiful is that? As a set, I'm such a fan. It looks so good in a white frame. Um, and then let me show you what I have in the living room. Okay, so in the living room, I have this print, which is one of my favorite prints ever. It's just of these two hands. Um, and it literally goes so well with the sofa. You would have seen it in my living room decor video from the last house. Um, but the two prints, do I put them either side? I don't know, but I'm gonna sort something out with the prints. Oh my God, I keep zooming in so much. Um, but anyway, I will just get on with the vlog. Hope you enjoy. Okay, so we're gonna go to Ikea, so I thought I'd film, um, because I need to get some bits for the filming room. This is literally my filming room now. It's a state, like it would actually give you anxiety. I'll show you, but it makes my anxiety so bad, so I can't even spend time in here at the minute. So I basically just need to get loads of storage for my clothes. This is what the room's like currently, like it's making my anxiety crazy. I don't know how I'm functioning, literally look at the wardrobe. I just need to sort through everything. I've got my coats on a rack and then I just got all my shoes and things I need to sell, things I need to put away, like my bags, things like that. But it's just such a mess. I already picked up this cabinet thing because it was literally only like $30 or something from Kmart. But it was literally just to sort my stuff out because I mean, I don't love it, but it's really handy. Like I have all my underwear and things like that. I put my bags or some of my bags in here. Um, and it's just so handy just to sort it. What I need is a chest of drawers for all my folded things. Um, and then I need to get some storage for my shoes because look at this. So I don't even know what I'm gonna do with the place. <laughs> 
but I need to move this somewhere. I'm gonna put a chest of drawers here, I think. Um, I quite like filming in this corner because, or on this wall because of the lighting, but I'm gonna put some pictures up so it's a nicer filming background. Why have you not got your shoes on? We try to get Instagram photos here because it's like just, you know, a car park. Um, so I thought cute, like car park vibes. Um, and we did it and it literally looked like I was on an episode of Power. Not in a good way. Why do I do this? <laughs> We're here. Right, mask on. Some more I mask. Am babies I'm gonna cry. get like a silk one. Right, ready, let's go. Not really funny, but this sofa looks a little bit like the cloud ones, like you know the fashionable white ones that everyone has these days. And it's actually really comfortable. I just sat on it. This is actually really cozy. For what? No, just for future reference. Oh. <laughs> it's actually nice, isn't it? Literally so I found yeah. this in IKEA, which is. 69 but it's actually very similar it's actually a little bit bigger to be fair so i could probably fit a bit more in this one but it's actually the same kind of as my kmart one but it's like double the price so this is cute i wish i had something like this like a center thing do you know what i mean like a little poof what have they done for storage like see i really just need something for my shoes but I don't know what. Yeah, maybe. How did you open that? Oh. I just need it to look neat. Like I just need to put my shoes in something because at the minute they're just on the floor. Not being funny, but <sighs> look at this bathtub. I know it's off topic, but I actually kind of love this. So I found this and it's just a bit of a cliche, like YouTuber. <laughs> can't argue with that price though. But you can't argue with the price. Um, I just need some storage, to be honest. So this is an option. Oh my God, all the Christmas decorations. This actually makes me like a bit teary because I want to go home for Christmas, but I don't think I will be able to. Okay, so for shoes, I'm thinking, do I just get like a big thing like this and just put them in there? Or do I get boxes and like put them in there and stack them? It's a bit of a difficult decision. To be fair with this, I can hide it. How many pairs of shoes you got? Wait, stick your foot in there. <laughs> no. Oh, stick your foot in. I mean, this is my. That is so small, oh my god. My... That is so small, isn't yeah, it's it? Small. So, what do I do? What's so bad. Max suggested this, and I can put so my. With the space that we've got, your best stuff. And then that. it can be hidden as well in the wardrobe. Like. So. You don't want things out in the open. I don't know, I just don't know if it really fit my shoes in there. You definitely want to fit your shoes in. It's only your boots. Alright. <laughs> I'm gonna get wasted. Got it. Got the goods. Let's go home. So I ended up just getting the basic bitch IKEA chest of drawers. Um, just because I feel like it just blends in to the room nicely. You don't really notice it as like a piece. And also, I'm in Australia, so I didn't want to get anything expensive. And I'm literally just filling it with my clothes at the minute. So I've got my comfies and I've got my jeans down here. Um, so yeah, I'm just working on that whilst watching Friends. I wanted to get this one because it's not that wide. So when you walk in the door, you don't really notice it. You kind of just like can walk in, there's still a lot of space. I've just got a few shoes that I need to sort out, but it's looking a lot clearer. This is full of stuff that I'm gonna put on Depop. I'm gonna Depop all of these as well. Okay guys. I've really made a dent, but it's such a mess. I really need to clean, hoover, everything. Um, but I've started to put my shoes in these boxes. Um, so I've got all like my heels and things in here. I've got my trainers in here. I have these like shelves, cabinet kind of thing. Um, and I need to just arrange them. I need to put um, my shoes in there. I'm gonna arrange them like this and then leave these ones open for like shoes, like the boots. I think they're gonna go this way, but I don't really like this bit here. So I'm gonna turn them around and just have them like this. I wanted to get some like woven boxes, but they're always sold out all the time. So I just had to like get these ones because you can't really like 
notice them. They don't stand out, so I feel like that's fine. And then in the squares, I'm just gonna put, I'm just gonna put like my big boots, like that. Kind of makes a feature out of them. Um, I've got these ones. These are so cute, by the way. These are on my recent Shein haul. And then I've got my lace up boots. And then I'll just put some trainers at the bottom. I mean, that looks kind of cute, doesn't it? I'm happy with that anyway. Okay, I've hung everything up and I've organized it into like jumpers and sweatshirts, shirts, and then like jackets and things like that. And on the other side, you can see all my jackets. Um, I've put my bags in here. I mean, it looks a bit messy, but it's really practical because I can see all my bags and I can just quickly like reach for them and grab them. Um, and they're also out the way. So yeah, I'm just gonna keep them like this for now. I might reorganize them to make them look nicer, but at the minute, that's fine for me. Then over here, I have this Kmart clothing rack which I'm just gonna put all my coats on. I need to organize them. But I do like having them on this rack instead of in the wardrobe because they take up a lot of space. Um, but I'm just deciding where to put this rack. Do I keep it next to the cubes? Or do I move it more over here? I'm just contemplating. There we go, we have all my coats. Organized, yes. Okay, so I'll show you the furniture that we already had from our last house that I'm gonna use in here. So I've just got this like ottoman. You can use it for storage. So I've got some stuff in there. Um, and it's just really cute. And I feel like I could put it in the middle of the room. I mean, it's really small. I kind of would want a bigger one for that, but it still looks cute. And it adds a bit of color as well to the room. But we also have this chair, which I absolutely love. Um, this was also from the last house. Um, by the way, this, Ottoman was from Fantastic Furniture and I think so was this. Just need to clean because it has just like marks um, just from moving it around. I think I've chipped it a little bit, no. Um, and it's just quite dusty. So yeah, I'm just gonna clean it and then we can start decorating it, fun. So I already had this blue vase from Kmart. It goes really nicely with the Ottoman, but I also got these from Kmart. They were like $6, which is like, three pounds something so really affordable obviously it doesn't look completely real but it still gives that effect so i like it so i've got some vases from target they had such good stuff in there like i actually can believe and they were quite inexpensive as well i think this was like a tenner um aussie dollars i love that that is just adorable i was gonna put something in there but i feel like because i have this do i need to don't know um and then I also got this one, which is cute. I also have these coffee table books that I might put on there. Do you know what? I've decided I'm gonna um, put the prints up first and then I know where I wanna put all the like vases and things. Um, so I've got some command strips. I actually swear by these. These are so good for rented properties because they literally just do not mark the walls at all and they keep the frames up on the walls forever. I'm definitely gonna go for these prints because I just want a bit of color in here. And I feel like also the orange with the blue is quite cool. And it's not mundane. Like I know everyone loves to go for like proper neutrals or like gray but I just want a bit of color in here. But yeah, I'm gonna go with these and put them, I don't know how high up to put them. Okay, so I've put the pictures up. They look so nice, I'm really happy with them. And now I just need to put some bits here. I don't want it to be too cluttered, but I do want it to look styled. So we'll take this and I think I wanna put it on this side. It does cover her bum. Um, and then I've got this and it does just look a bit plain. Where's the other one? Okay, and this one's here. I think I want to put this with this. I don't want to put anything in it, I don't think. Or do I do it with this in the middle, like in between the photos? Okay, so I've got this one that I'm going to put next to the navy vase, I think. And then I thought I would put my perfume out just because it's quite a cute bottle. And it, sorry, that's horrible, a bottle. <laughs> and um, it just adds a cool like shape there, do you know what I mean? So I feel like I might leave it kind of like this. And then I've got the books and I'm literally 
just gonna leave them in the middle I think because there needs to be something in the middle I've played around with it a lot um, and this is kind of the best I can do with what I have at the minute and then this one oh my god I just love this so much um, I put with this plant again had that from the old house and also the glass lamp that I had in our bedroom but we only use one so I was like do you know what I'm gonna bring it in here and yeah so this is what I've come up with I think it looks cute. I put the ottoman like in the middle of the room and this will just be a nice filming background. And then here we sorted out my shoes. So it's just like so easy to just grab whatever I want. Um, and then of course we have the rack. And then over here, this is a little bit messy because I'm actually just keeping this room for like my content. I have a mirror here, but then I have my ring light and then my tripod and then my phone stand as well. Um, I'm just keeping it here. It's near the plugs and it saves me having to get them out every time I need them. They're just there and ready to use. So this bit looks a bit messy, but it's like the corner of the room. It doesn't really matter. It's just really convenient to have them there. But this room is the weirdest shape. Like literally it's normal along here. And then suddenly it's like the weirdest, but like you can't even tell on camera, but it's just the most difficult shape for a room in terms of putting the furniture out, but it's the best I could come up with. So if you have any suggestions, let me know what you would do. Cause still like these bits of furniture, I'm not sure. Like I moved this over here and it just didn't look right. And then I don't know, I was just a bit confused with it all. This is what it's like in the mirror. It's just nice and organized, isn't it? So I'm happy with it. And I also have a little C if I need. <laughs> and it's just what I wanted. I wasn't trying to make it look like a show home by any means, but it's such an improvement. So I'm happy with it. Look at it before. And look at it now. I mean, I really cannot complain. So yeah, that was my little room makeover. Um, I really hope you enjoyed it. I know it wasn't too drastic, but um, I'm honestly gonna really enjoy my time in this room for however long we're here. I just love videos like this. I think they are so satisfying. But yeah, really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more videos like this every single week. Thank you so much for watching guys and I'll see you next time. Bye.